Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. We are about to hop in a new hole. Let's go. So in the last video, we made our way through the sewers, met Fawful, found out how to use beans to get more badges, and we're pretty much told by Fawful as well that this is not the right hole. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> but yeah, but yeah, we need to go actually to the hole in the viewing tower. So uh, I'm not expecting to really be able to do anything here, but I, I did want to see what is over here, you know, if anything. Yeah, we, we can do nothing here. There's we're, we're gated off just just like the last one. We we can't progress any further here. It looks like there's no other paths over here either. Right. Yeah. No. OK, so this is not where we need to be. So we'll come back to here later. For now, let's make our way back to the viewing tower. OK, so we're at the uh, viewing tower. So I think what we need to do is just hit the switch, use the bro ball, get to the top, get to the new hole, progress the story, right? Let's go ahead and do it. 25 seconds. Should be a walk in the park now that we got the uh, bro ball, given that it is faster than walking as per Toadsworth. Oh, yeah, this is way better than walking up these stairs. Now it just comes down to me having a uh, good control of the ball. I, I need to have flawless control of the ball to get up there in time. I need to make sure that I got a good grip on it. Wait, did I miss it? Okay, there we go. <laughs> nice. We made it up to where we had to go. So this should take us to the new hole that we need to go in. Yeah, here we go. We're in the right hole now. Uh, let's get the babies real quick. And there is a bean we got to collect. And I do want to make sure to get those because we can trade the beans for badges back in the sewers at Fawful. And there were a couple of badges that I wanted to pick up. Ooh, look at that view. And there's no safety rail right here. So someone enjoying it could fall over and like die. But it's a really good view. But the safety measures are not there. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, let's go into the right hole this time. <laughs> we've, we've gone to the to two hole to the uh, wrong hole twice now. So I think it's about time we go to the right hole and continue progressing the story. The glitzy. Thought for a second I thought that said glitzy desert. I was gonna be like glitz, glizzy. Actually, I was thinking about uh. Uh, the glitz pit from the uh, Thousand Year Door. I, I was I'm watching my uh, friend's uh, let's play of Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door, and I'll, I'll link his his channel here in case y'all want to go and check out his uh, let's play of Paper Mario: The Thousand Year Door. It is great. He he's like such a great um, let's player. He has like really good commentary. I really enjoy his content, and I think you'll enjoy it too. So. I will definitely link his channel in the description below. Feel free to give it a, a check out if you're interested in seeing more our Mario. Oh, it's blocked behind ice. Yeah, if you're interested in seeing more Mario RPG stuff, definitely give his uh, channel and Let's Play series a, a, a view because it is top notch and he is a great storyteller and just overall very fun to listen to. It's a shroob. It's an army of shrooms and they're running out of the Koopa Castle. He's like the uh, the uh, air traffic controller people. No, no, not the controller people. The, the folks on the runways who have the cones and are directing planes where to go. He's directing the army just like that. Ha! You saps are all wet. Waltz into the dome's front door and you're sure to get spotted and carted away lickety split. What? Remember me, huh? Seeing the Koopa Chronicles reporter doll again has got you all goofy, does it? That's right. Kylie Koopa's got your number. And she's got a scoop. <laughs> No time to chat. I got a hunch this story's gonna be bigger than Yochi's Island. Hoo ha! 
Here's the scoop. Princess Shroob's gonna be arriving here any minute now. Yeah, there's gonna be a big to-do celebrating the conquest of the Mushroom Kingdom. And that's just the fries, boys. Here's the burger. Some other princess types coming too. My sources indicate this other damsel likes pink and she may be royalty of some sort. What? Princess Peach? The doll they're bringing here is Princess Peach? Princess Peach came here in a time doohickey and got pinched by Princess Shroob. <laughs> what the fuck were the babies doing? I missed it. But I saw them smashing their hammer and it was so adorable. I gotta get this straight. You're snooping about trying to rescue the adult Princess Peach. Sounds like the balloon juice to me, fella, but what a scoop. It'd be, it'd be if you're on the level. <laughs> Alrighty then, you need to get into the dome so you can nab that princess, right? Well, word on the street is there's supposed to be a secret entrance around here. Word on the street ain't so specific though, so I don't know about its whereabouts. You're not getting in through here regardless, so you gotta find that secret entrance. Here's the only dirt I got. The entrance is connected somehow to four desert statues. Now knuckle down and find that entrance, you big lug. If I've got some sleuthing of my own to take care of. Good luck, Whiskers. <laughs> that was pretty adorable. Uh, let's see, can I throw the babies up here? No, I cannot. So how am I supposed to get this one right here? Maybe hover from over here? Yeah, that seems like the play. Let me try to get this really quickly. Oh, can I reach? Can I reach? No, I can't reach. Hang on, I gotta use the big bros. So I'm guessing we gotta go ball, cancel. Oh god, hang on. Get my buttons mixed up. Get the uh, thing here. Fly with Luigi over, right? This is the play. Oh yeah, there we go. It's all coming together. Look at that. Was it worth it? Absolutely, for those 50 coins. It was definitely worth it to uh, go through all of that work. Okay, so we need to find a secret entrance, which is gonna be somewhere around here. Uh, let's see, green shells, totally useful. And new enemy. What is this thing called? A shrewba diver? <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. Okay, let's see if we can kill it really quickly. Are you beefy? Are you a beefy tanky boy? Don't go after Luigi. He went after Luigi. Oh my god, he was defenseless and he had a baby. You deserve that. But yeah, I, I'll definitely link uh, my friend Butter's channel in the uh, description below. And you know, if you're interested in like Mario RPG content, you know, give his his uh, channel of you. I actually do plan on hopefully having like some type of collaboration with him in the future. You know, it'd be really, really fun to uh... <laughs> totally mess that up. Okay, wait, I don't remember. Wait, no, wait, it was B then Y. Yeah, there we go. That's what it was. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's coming back to me now. Here we go. I'm a little rusty because it's been about like a week or two since I've uh, played this. So my skills are, are not keeping up, you know, with this uh, video. Oh no. Can I just jump on it? Do I even need to? Do I even need to hit it? Okay, we're not going to waste our time with the hammer. I'm just going to kill it. But yeah, I, I would love to actually do a collaboration one day. We are in discussion, so maybe that'll come to the channel one day and we'll have a collaboration with butters himself playing some uh fun game together either multiplayer or doing like a co-op story that would be really dope oh can i get up here no i can't get up here yet right no okay but yeah i don't know we'll see what happens in the future one day it'd be really cool if we could do that also i'm planning to have some other collaborations with some other uh uh, let's players I talked to, uh, Charlie, who's linked in some of my other videos, as well as Tater Slater. She's also uh, someone I would like to do some collaborations with. We're, we all kind of uh, uh, connected and, you know, oh, God, I only got 10 seconds to get there. What? How am I supposed to get there in 10 seconds? 
Oh, wait, wait. Okay, wait, it's clicking. I gotta send the babies alone, right? Yeah, that's what I gotta do. Okay. But yeah, I do, I, I have connected with some other Let's Players and, you know, it would be really fun to uh, uh, do some Let's Plays together. I, I personally am a huge fan of like doing co-op games together because I, I, I've mentioned this in my uh, other, oh, where does this one go? This one probably, this one has to go to the bottom one, right? That makes the most sense, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's, it's making sense to me how to solve this this now. So we just got to put the babies over here first, and then we'll kind of move everybody counterclockwise. But yeah, I'm, I, I've mentioned this during my uh, live stream. I'm actually a really big fan of like, you know, couch co-op games or co-op games in general where you have to work together with someone. What do you do? You talk? Where are you going, son? You want to move on? You're going to have to play a time game. You got to hit the block that will appear beyond the wall over there four times before four, before time runs out. You get it done, son, and I'll let you pass as an official desert perimeter runners. Uh, okay. So I need the big bros here, actually. Um... Before I do that, can I get this one down here? Let me just, I'm, I'm gonna turn into the ball. It's faster than walking. What am I doing walking? Oh, cool, I can just warp them here. That actually saves a lot of time. Let me just warp them back over here real quick. Because they're not gonna be able to progress. So let's see, can I, can I leave them over here? First, what's in here? Anything good? Oh, there's some stuff in here. But I can't push any buttons yet. Wait, maybe I could read something up here, right? Roll into the ball cannon to the right to be sent flying high. Okay. So let's get into the cannon. And fire! Fire the cannon! Nice. But I don't think this is where I need to go to be honest damn that's a lot of that's a lot of bro items new enemy it's a bomb bomb let's go and blow it up okay kind of failed jumping on it there uh I'm just gonna use a uh, ice flower because I got so many of them so let's just mash real quick and uh get rid of all these guys oh that did nothing to the uh to the bombs um she's a shell to finish him off real quick get rid of this dude should be dead in like maybe three more hits i think he had around like 90 health yeah there we go oh he juked me And then this one has its defense down, so it's, yeah, die really quickly. You should die too right now, because you uh, you took a counter hit from Mario. Okay. So that probably can warp me back to where I was over there, but oh, we're back at the beginning, right? This is where we were, right? Oh, this is where the babies need to be. Maybe there's a uh, pipe around here or something. Maybe, maybe. Oh, dude, I really feel like I'm I'm not maneuvering this area well. I feel like I'm I'm not I'm not going the uh, right path. I feel like I got a little bit lost somewhere. Uh, where, where is, where's the warp pipe? Because this is where the babies need to be. Okay, so if the babies can reach this, this will work out. Oh, they can reach. Okay. This is perfect. Oh, oh wait, I got the big bros in the wrong spot. But it's okay. We got we got the bro ball. We can traverse this area really quickly, right? Two seconds. Come on. You can make it. I can't make it, actually. I'm off. But now I can. 
So hit this one. And then the babies hit the other one, right? Yep, there we go. Nice. Okay, and then I thought that the babies could only reach certain statues, like because of height requirements, but I mean, if they could pretty much be on the left side, then I can just put the big bros on the right side and uh, pretty much do this uh, like puzzle pretty easily. So let me just put the bros over here really quickly. There it is. And then switch back to the babies and this area should be done. Right. Yep. There we go. Nice. Okay, so now I do need to actually bring the big bros back over here because um, before I end the video, I do want to uh, quickly just see everything that we can see and pretty much pick up all the loot that we need to pick up. So I'm going to cut around for the next like minute or so, just showing off uh, what loot is available to us at the moment. Oh yeah, I got Mario to level 15. Uh, I'm just going to keep boosting stash. I think I said I was going to get stash up to like 40 and then I would focus pretty much on power for the rest of the game. So like Luigi's case, your power is getting boosted up even higher because your stash is already pretty, pretty good. We are speed. Ka-chow. Should not be too much of an issue. Oh god, it's a maze. It's a maze kind of ish. Maybe it's not a maze. Maybe I'm overreacting. But either way, it shouldn't be too much of an issue because we Yeah, got the bro ball technique. So now we could bring the babies down here. Hopefully he opens up a warp pipe so we could just take the babies down here. Oh yeah, level 16, baby Mario. Gonna keep boosting that, pow! 53 is nice. Same for baby Luigi. Gonna keep giving him more power. Unlimited power. Oh yeah, level 16. Gotta keep giving that stash more power. Uh, for Luigi, just keep boosting his attack. Power is looking pretty good for both bros. All right, we made it to the purple block. Let's hit it and see what happens. Huh. Okay, so we just dropped that down. Not going to lie, I was expecting it to drop that other block by the blue pipe near the save book on the left side of the map. Gotta do a quick heal. I've gotten so many items, by the way, from just going through this area. Like, I think I want to show this off. I got like so many pocket chomps. I'm at 31 now. Because every time I beat a bomb arm, it would pretty much give me like one to two pocket chomps. So I like stocked up on all of them. Oh, oh missing coin, missing coin. Oh, I probably missed some right there. It's okay. Anything over here? Peppers. Oh, fell. Okay. But I think this is probably where I'm going to end the video. Made some pretty good progress here. Um, next video, we will use this secret entrance to see what's going on inside this fortress. So as always, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.